luggage? That's right. This is a DeWalt 7500 BTU model. And also you can see it's snowing. DXH75KT. And also you can see it's winter. Santa Claus already came. Okay. This Ooh. is the problem. Flip the light switch on there, please. All right, this is the problem. All the way on high heat. So this is made for kerosene, diesel. I've seen a couple videos on this about what the problem could be. It's just spitting that fuel right out. We use farm diesel in ours and it says it's okay. But we're gonna try to take it apart and look at it and see what's wrong with it. Right there is what you can use in it. So let's get this thing apart. All right, let's get these, what is it, nine screws out. They have these little lock washers on, so don't lose them. different sides. We're gonna check in here and see if it fires. Let me get around here. Should be right in there. the fire oh we, you see we got that a cracked hose every, right here do you see that smoke everybody let's try it one more time all right would this being dry rotted like that this hose is crap. It's dry rotted here too. It needs a high temperature hose. It's, oh. it's spraying plenty of fuel right there, you can see. It's just not enough. All right, so let's get this hose replaced. It's just like regular old vacuum line hose. This thing is not old at all. I can't believe it's already dry rotted like that. Let's look right here. Tiny one. These are little sheet metal screws. I did disconnect the power too. Okay. Not gonna be as hard a repair as it looked like. Cause this look just fed feeds right through there. Huh. That's what we need. 
That's just two years of use. This other one right here, it goes to that side. You can see that white thing back there. That's where it goes into the fuel tank. So let's get this thing replaced and get this thing working. I'm gonna see if I have a piece of hose. All right, I found this. So let's plug her up and look. Slip this on here. Alright. So let's just test it. All right, moment of truth. Let's see if it's just that hose. See if I can slip that up a little higher. Let me try something else. You know, this hose is silicone. It may even be better than the hose that was on it. Let's get her pushed up a little higher. I think I am gonna change this out. too bad this elbow where that hose was goes into here and gets air from here which is the intake filler machine wash and dry every 500 hours is necessary It don't smell like, oh, this is it right here. Not that big thing. Oh, that looks good. I'm kind of happy with that. I don't think I'm going to mess with it. I bet that silicone hose lasts more than two years. I know it gets hot in there, but those things are good for, I think, 400 degrees. Let's double check and make sure it works before we put the cover on it. I think I see know how this system works. This thing pulls up into this nozzle. This is where the diesel comes out of the tank at. But I bet this is the pressure to shoot that diesel into there and make it work. If you know, leave a comment. Let us know. Let's get this thing back together.
one more test run. Hope that video helped you. Like and subscribe if you want to. And check back in for more videos. Have a good one. Like and subscribe.